basically. I've taught probably over 4,000 students since I've been here. Most of them have been teenagers or you know, 19, 20, and so basically I've been a father to 4,000 teenagers. And I think that takes a little bit of patience uh, because sometimes things happen that are sort of, sort of crazy and you have to be able to roll with the punches. I actually started my Auburn career in um, pre-vet. And so when I met Dr. Duty first my freshman year, I also had him for principles um, of biology my freshman year of 2002 and um, was going to be a vet and just saw his passion for his students and for teaching and I actually decided to change my major and now I'm loving it. By using sort of outrageous examples, it, it helps a lot. It helps the students to recall the principal and the principal is the important thing. Dr. Duty is a great professor and I have two degrees, one in my country, one here and now I make as the third degree. And I did not meet uh, since so many years many uh, teachers like Dr. Duty who has a gift to teach. He once said something very powerful to me. I figured he's so smart. I figured he came from this really smart, huge high school where everybody kind of knew this stuff. And what he once told me when he was asking me, what, how much was your, how big was your graduating class? And I remember telling him 30. And he said, I graduated 40, you can do this. And that felt so good. Well, I would say, uh, again, know your material. Uh, second thing, go into the classroom with a smile on your face and have a smile for everybody. That helps because they automatically smile back and they, and they begin to think, well, maybe this person isn't, isn't so bad after all. And uh, go in there with an open mind and work really hard. Uh, teaching is one of those things that a lot of people think is an easy thing to do and in reality it's not an easy thing to do. It requires a lot of work uh, both outside and inside the classroom and so you have to be willing to work really hard in some cases. Even if you think that teaching comes naturally to you, uh, that doesn't replace hard work. It's always nice to win an award. The money's nice. I'd be lying to say that the money wasn't nice. but. Uh, it's a job that I do because I like it, so the award is just the icing on the cake. It's uh, not an end all in itself. <laughs>